ultimately our main enforcement powers is we're maintaining the peace. So as long as nobody's killing each other, like I told you on the phone, mm -hmm. tearing stuff up, hey, yeah. you know. Um, is this your yes, that, that's home. Yeah. You're going this guy? Right. Had this cast out, long cast in parallel. Just really slow, nice pauses. And then, bam, boy, I sat there looking, I was <laughs> What's up, guys? Hey, Manny B here with the Skinny Water Boys. I'm here with my boy, my brother, Sammy B. We're going to be chasing some big bass. We're trying to get him on some big bass while he's in town. He's in town from Oklahoma. Uh, we're hitting a little stream. Uh, big shout out to Lone Star River Riders. Hey, stop what you're doing right now. Hit that subscribe button. Appreciate y'all watching. Thanks for the love. Let's get on some big bass. What do you say, Sam? Let's do it. Let's do it. Samuel. The swim bait. Check it out, guys. Twenty two seven five on the six inch citizen pearl beast of a bass see Skinny. that now look at that guys what was that no we're not this is, we're staying in the river. We're not getting on y'all's property. This is the public. What was that? Oh, we're not. Well, we gotta walk up the riverbed. You call them, let them know. We're out here walking in the riverbed. Okay. Yeah. He's like, this is the creek. I was like, no, it's not. The creek's further up. The creek can be uh, private property because depending on how big it is. But this, this is the, he's, I was like, we're not freaking getting on your property. He's like, well, you're walking around. I was like, this is the riverbed. I was like, call the game warden. And I told him it was that same game warden that we ran to. And he's like, oh. What was that? I just got off the phone with the game warden. Uh-huh. Assigned to this county. Yeah. Really? Yeah. Oh, you want him to come get you? Yeah. Okay. Get him. Get him in. Are you? Look at Samuel catching a bass while these people are trying to get the game warden called on us. <laughs> Dude, you slam it? Let's go. Hey, they're salty right now just watching us. <laughs> Alright guys, so I just talked to the game same exact game we're in like by a miracle we called the same one. And they're telling I told him where we are. Uh, God, that's a freaking chunk, dude. Sammy B. Look at that boy. So we're waiting for the game warden to come talk to us and tell us we're in the right because this guy thinks we're trespassing. I don't want to start any wars or fights with landowners. That's not a good way to representation of anglers. So we're gonna get situated. I'm gonna wait. In the meantime. In the meantime. <laughs> In the meantime. Don't mind if I do. Here. So. Okay. 
careful. Let's see how big she goes. Mouth closed. 21 or 20, 20 quarters. 23 quarters. Let's go, Sammy B. Oh, put me on the mat. Hey, uh, this one's for you, Presley Ballard. Uh, we're gonna release this beast. Hey, shout out, shout out my boy Blake Brown, too. Mr. Buster. Tell us, all right, Sammy B. Tell, tell us how you did it. Okay, so I was just fishing. I had this cast out, long cast in parallel, just reeling it slow, nice pauses, and then bam, boy, sat there looking. I was, boy, got that shit, boy. Next thing you know, man, I was just going. Bam. All right, guys, the game warm just showed up. Let's go talk to him. How's it going? Howdy, Manuel. Dennis Gasway, man. Nice to meet you. Good to meet you. That's my brother, Samuel. Oh, perfect. Well, did y'all have any luck? Yeah, I got a 22 or 23 inch bass and really? cut, yeah, I cut a nice, throwing everything back. Yeah, excuse me just a second. Yeah, for sure. Hey, bro. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, I talked to the, uh, the constable here who was a who was a warden here for years and years and years and years and he said back in 2004 the texas general land office came down and they in their opinion they called also one and the same mm -hmm. uh like i said i'm uh non-navigable really yeah that that was their opinion okay so this opinion. is what i was just explaining to to the, the landowners and i'm fixing to explain to them as well um there's a there's a Ultimately, our main enforcement powers is that we're maintaining the peace. So as long as nobody's killing each other, like I told you on the phone, mm -hmm. tearing stuff up, hey, yeah. you know. Um, so ultimately, it boils down to a court opinion. And there is no court opinion on this. So so that's where everybody's kind of like, uh, we go on opinions based off of what, mm -hmm. like the GLO says. So GLO, like I said, no four deem this non-navigable now the question that me and, and the constable were having i was like okay if it's non-navigable do the people still have a right to navigate it yeah basically right so uh that's where he and i were kind of kind of having a discussion our main deal is is if y'all can get along and say hey ask and and we always go from there like i said i you know it, it, that's uh, that's that's the hard part. Deal is, is if we push it to court, right? It can go one or two ways. Mm -hmm. Either you win or you lose. Yeah. <laughs> Main deal is, is we spend a lot of money and probably yeah, yeah, for yeah. nothing. Yeah. So, uh, main deal is, is, is everybody, you know, just just kind of get, get along, and that's what and that's what I wanted to come over here and, and come talk to you because I mean I was I'm unfamiliar with it myself. Main deal is is. Everybody says it's an opinion, it's an opinion, it's an opinion. Yeah. And uh, I went back through some old parks and wildlife stuff as I was driving up here, um, and and it was just that. It says, okay, well, back in 1976, when somebody tried doing this, they established that it was going to be up to each individual court to the to decide that. Mm -hmm. So it's just a conglomeratory yeah. mess. Um, uh, main deal is if we can all get along or whatever we all decide to do from here well then then we decide to do it mm -hmm. um, I was just hoping to go up maybe one uh, another pull up and then turn right back around We're staying on the riverbed because it's obviously over you know was it 30 feet wide yeah, riverbed and, and seeing that's the deal so yeah. navig so navigability you know you have nav nav navigability by fact and navigability by statute mm -hmm. so and like I said, the GLO is the one that usually says, yay, it is, or nay, mm -hmm. it's not. And their opinion on this one was, no, it's not. So so when it comes to something like that, in my opinion, mm -hmm. is is uh, you may have a right to be on the water, but as soon as you step off, then it's private property. You mm -hmm. run that risk. Okay. Uh, and like step off out on no, the side no, or in, even, in the yeah, middle? In, in, in the water, because this is not considered... This is not considered uh, uh, 
like the land under it, the beds and bottoms, oh, okay. the, the property of the state, this mm -hmm. is not considered property of the state. Now, the water may be considered public because you, have, you may have a public access point to it mm -hmm. from the original, yeah. but the land under it, the state doesn't have state doesn't have a right. Is that the same thing with the, the other two? No, no, different entities here. Mm -hmm. But if it's if it's considered non-navigable, then the, then the state, the public, does not have does not have the right to the bottom. Mm -hmm. But the water may be public. That's so weird. It's weird, right? So so that's, that's just so that's where we normally you know we we take King's X out of it and say, okay, can I come up here? Mm -hmm. And it, and it may be and it may be handled by mere permission. Because I can tell you, we run in, we run into the deal to where, if landowner says, "Hey, you're trespassing," you've already been given notice, right? So you can be given notice by signs, purple paint, verbal or written. Okay. So if he says, "Hey, you're trespassing," you continue to go through. He has the right to file on. Okay. Mm -hmm. Vice versa, if it's public and you have the right to be there, then they can't mess with you. You know. Mm -hmm. So, but in here, it's a special circumstance. Yeah. Because there is a public access point to it, um, it and and that's the deal. Do you have a right to the water? Mm -hmm. or you may have a right to the water, but not to the land. Mm -hmm. So, so that's is that that's a confusing part for me that I got to get answered. Yeah. So, I mean, I'm being straight. And, you know, we're not trying to put anybody in jail, but I have to answer to the owners. Of course. And the owners are in the opinion that these are non-navigable. And it is not navigable, uh, uh, according to the GLO back yeah. in 2004. But, you know, you tried to get one of them to come up here and testify in court. Mm -hmm. Good luck. You know? Yeah. So, so everybody's starting from the bottom. But uh, but I'm, I'm going based off of what if it is, what if it isn't, okay? So if it's so if it's a non-navigable stream, then hypothetically, you wouldn't have a right to the bottom. Mm -hmm. If it is a navigable stream, then you do. Uh, yeah, I'm just trying to fish. Like, yeah, yeah, exactly. We're not no, I get it. disrespecting uh, nothing, picking up trash. No, no, and... yeah, no, no, and that's and that's cool. Like, and of course, you know, I'm sure these landowners deal with folks totally different from you guys. Mm -hmm. It's kind of like. Yeah, they give us a bad name. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> they you know, ruin it yeah, yeah, we totally, you know, and I totally get it because I see it on both sides. I see folks just wanting to fish and recreate, enjoy the water, and that's what we're about. Mm -hmm. So if you have a right to be there, then you have a right to be there. If you don't have a right to be there, then you don't have a right to be there, and vice versa. If they have a right to be there, they have a right to be there, and if they don't, they don't. In this circumstance, it's kind of one of those, it's kind of like, I hate to say gray, but mm -hmm. it's but it's gray, at least for me at this point. Yeah. And there's nobody in parts of Walmart that's going to sit there and say, this is public or this is private. Yeah, I'd like for them to understand my point. Yes. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, owner that doesn't live here. Mm -hmm. And if I start letting people come through, my owners are down here this weekend with 12 to guests. Mm -hmm. And they drive down here, and here they are going, and I gave permission to go through here with their kayak. Uh -huh. Then. And that's the deal, is, 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 is they may have the right to just kayak it, but not get off. Right. right. Yeah. And, and that's, I understand that part, yes, but my, my bosses are under the impression course. that they, they don't, that they, uh -huh. that they, well. Yes, sir. And, that, and, that's, and that's the confusing part for me as well. Like I said, okay, so if it's non-navigable. Like I said, I can't give them permission that my, my bosses, unless you can tell them they're legal and I'm wrong. I said, I don't know. Well, see, no, I, nobody knows. Then how, how am I to mm -hmm. do my job? Exactly. Yeah. This is crazy. They left it to an opinion. Like, I mean, that's... And, and it's an opinion, yeah. You can yeah. sit down and look at it. Like I said, Parks and Wildlife, we don't deem public and private. Mm -hmm. We don't say, yeah, this is public. You sit there and, and, and run them off if, if they may have a, a right access to it. And then, on, like, on the flip side, I can't sit there and say, well, by God, you can sit there and run up there and I can't do anything either. It's, it's a weird predicament mm -hmm. for me to be in. Um, it's been done. Ultimately, guys, what do y'all want to do? I really just wanted to fish that last pull and turn it right, right back around. Okay. And, head. and if he's saying no, well then, then yeah. now we're at a stalemate. Mm -hmm. So what we, you know. Well, like, what if we just turn around and then, you know, talk to y'all, all like, you know, offsite, you know, and we'll figure this out later. And we can't. Yeah, mm -hmm. like I said, we can, we can all, I can, like I said, at the end of the day, I can't say, yes, you're right, you can patrol that up there, or you mm -hmm. can do that, or no, you're wrong, you can't do that. The only thing I can do is like, hey, maybe contact this person. Um, I can I can probably try to find the stuff back in 2004 mm -hmm. and send it to you where, where it says that. Yeah. Mind if I take a piss on one of these trees? 
You're behind the tree. I don't want you to make me excited. <laughs> ben, I'm, I'm just going to ask you. Mm -hmm. you. You want... You mean just take you back and then we figure all this stuff out later? Uh... Or do you want to uh, do you want a kayak back and we try to figure all this stuff out? What do you think, I'm Sam? I'm trying to help you. Yeah. Yeah. We can go down yeah, we can go back. Yeah. And drag back because we still are gonna fit. Man, guys, I appreciate you understanding. Dude, this is a this is a this is it's weird. A pain, it's a pain in the butt, brother. Um, yeah. And they know they tried to they, they try to like. And I've had some landowners come through on navigable rivers and just say, hey, y'all can't be here. I say, yeah, we can. Mm -hmm. They say, well. I'm gonna target practice right here. I want you to know that, and that takes it to a totally different dynamic. Mm -hmm. This guy's just being—he's being hard-headed, and I've known yeah. him a long time, and I know he's being hard-headed. Yeah, but it's like, like I told him right before you guys come up here, I was like, they can push the issue, and you're wrong, and if you're wrong, then you're like, mm -hmm. it's gonna be, but you know, it's gonna be bad, or it can flow the other direction. You're wrong, and they're gonna turn around and come back and say. <laughs> now mm -hmm. I'm gonna follow him, and I, it, it's it's yeah it's very slow. Yeah, how about we just dad? Go, how you doing? How you doing? How you doing? Yeah, we're on. Both at once. All right, guys. So long story short, the area we are in was deemed non-navigable by opinion. You know, like what, what did you say, 16 years ago, Sam? Yeah, uh, 2004, to be exact. So it was by an opinion, it's not a law. And the, the guy wasn't even a landowner, he was the foreman of the ranch, and he was just being hard-headed, and just super annoyed. So basically what we did was, we came to the conclusion that the game warden's gonna figure out, you know, what, uh, you know what they mean by non-navigable like can you can you not can you access the river section of the river and only stay in the water and not touch the ground underneath like that's on the bottom of the water of the river because that's private property or is it completely public you know so I was in, like either either of us were not in the wrong or the right it's a very gray area according to them both two game wardens showed up super cool guys and you'll see that you already saw that on the clips but it was just a great area and we already wasted like an hour and a half or something like that dude dude i was just out there trying to catch some fish we pick up our trash we got our fishing license we respect the waters going the great outdoors and there's some beautiful weather out there today and it kind of ruined everything but i mean it's definitely uh something to look into figure out who was in the right, who was in the wrong, what, uh, we gotta figure out this gray area, you know? Yeah, so we just left, we're like, whatever, man, we're not gonna stay here trying to argue, and, you know, definitely the old man was like 70 some years old, and ain't nothing better to do but piss other people off, ruin other people's days, but let me know in the comments what you think about the gray area, like, what the hell? Because when it comes down to do it, I know my rights. And I was just head down, catch some bass. And they told me, get down from that kayak. I said, no. He said, you come out from that water. I said, no, I know my rights. <laughs> come get me. <laughs> come get me. Oh, real quick, guys. Hey, let me know in the comments below who you got. Popeye's chicken sandwich versus the Chick-fil-A <laughs> sandwich. We've been trying, we, everybody's talking about it. I think it's pretty good, pretty damn close. But the chipotle sauce or spicy sauce they have in the spicy chicken sandwich at Popeyes definitely made it slap. I have to give one more shout out. I'm never on these videos, I never get to see my brother, but I appreciate him for taking me out. I had a blast. It was one of the best trips I've had in a long time. Boy was just slamming. I mean decent little fish, but then I caught one really decent fish. But then uh, another shout out to my boy there in Oklahoma. His name's Billy. Down Home Pursuit YouTube channel. Y'all check it out. He's got some cool hunting and fishing videos as well. Appreciate it. Hell yeah. Might have to get up there and get on some fish. We'll check it out. But thank y'all so much for watching, guys. Hey, if you're not already subscribed, hey, you know the deal. Thanks for the love. See y'all next episode. Do it! Yeah.